Ooh, what's that? Ooh, they're rock people. Oh no, that's some sort of angry hippo. Die! What's cracking, people? Angelic Mayhem here. So, welcome to Raider Z. This is a game that just popped up on Steam today. It is a free-to-play MMORPG uh, that is based around, apparently, according to the promotional material that I've seen, um, these massive raiding parties, okay? So, if you're into MMOs, and you like to go out raiding, this m was is probably a game that you are going to want to take a look at. Uh, I am going to spare you the um, tutorial area, and we're just going to get right into the game. Uh, I appear to be in some kind of pirate ship that is uh, themed in still, even though it's January the 4th, we are still dealing with Christmas. So, <laughs> that's a little odd, but, you know, whatever. Uh, this is one of our quest givers. Something you need when to you click on her, this is what you get. I'm gonna go see Blacksmith Loco. Morton Gear, he'll make you a weapon you can be proud of. Now, you cannot control yourself while in midair, so once you, whoa, once you project yourself, that's it. You are going to where you are going to go. And there we are, like such. Hello, drunkards. These are my minions. Do my bidding. They don't care. Oh, we got crabs. Look at ooh, oh, look at that. That is a crab impaling what appears to be some sort of lizard person. Here, let me help. Everybody dies! Come on! Bang, bang, bang. Look at this. This is the most inappropriate place for a boat. How are they gonna get this thing in the water? Dude, seriously, I suspect that they were a pirate vessel that just literally beached itself, and then they were like, you know what? Let's not even bother. We'll just open up a restaurant and call it a day. Look, there's trees growing on it. That's how long it's been here? All the sails are all messed up. That's fine. Miguel, the broken mast. Looking for something specific? Ah, he is a shop. Smiling sword Lolita. Hello? I'm Abstentia. It's nice to meet you. Ah. I never used to wear makeup, but now I wear a lot of it. <laughs> Take care. End conversation. That's fine. Good luck with that. Ah, this is my blacksmith. Hold okay. on a sec. Oops. Can you help me? Clean up at the beach. All right. View quest details. Ah, sweet. And it tells you all about the reward. That's nice. Accept. See you next time. Look at this hawk. Oh, riding mounts. Okay, I get it. Friendly Nadia. How friendly is she? The atmosphere here has gone really sour after Moken's betrayal. We used to be like family, but now we're trying to kill each other. To be honest with you, it really gets me how Moken calls us traitors and toothless sharks without an ounce of dignity. Nice. Take care. Be on the lookout for Moken. Now you can climb on basically anything. In the tutorial, basically what happened was uh, they gave you just a brief hint of what the combat is going to look like. And so you you meet like this um like this guard captain, okay, and he drafts you into the military, which lasts about ten minutes. There are these things everywhere. I do not know what they do. Look, there's living trees. Oh, so anyway, he drafts you into the military, and then you go on one campaign, and he's like, all right, well, that's good enough, and then you're done. So that's just the, uh, the little tutorial area. Get you get you in all your equipment and stuff. Um, I have rekeybound everything. Uh, this game has okay rekeybinding. You just have to be careful not to double up by accident because it's not very good at um, making sure, like if you, I had two things um, attached to G. One of them was talk to an NPC and the other one was something I still don't know what it is yet. And so, uh, you know, I, at one point I went to go talk to an NPC and for like 10 minutes I couldn't talk to anyone. I was like, what is going on? And here it turns out I had re-keybound both of them to the same exact thing. So uh, that's just one thing to kind of throw out there. 
All right, so I guess I have to. I'm killing these crabs. Is that the deal? Here, come here, crab. Okay, so this is nutritious crab meat. Sweet. I have to collect all my loot. Oh, I probably should have read that before I just snatched it up. There is no running in this game. This is literally how quickly you can move, which is a missed opportunity, I must say. All right, now what did he give me? Trisha's crab meat. Mysterious beach sand. Which I had to acquire from a crab. I couldn't just bend down and pick it up myself. Acquire all. Thank you, crab. Look at this thing, this monstrosity they built on the beach. I bet you they, the engineer, after they realized they couldn't get off the boat off the beach, they probably flayed him. They made him walk the plank. And there's no way to hop on there. Okay. Ah. Minor leg injury. Oh, now I'm slowed. There we go. Now it goes away. That's pretty cool, I guess. I mean, unless you're in combat. Or busy. Like if you're a busy person and you don't have all day to wander around with a broken leg. Yeah. See you Women's next power, time. Baby. I didn't have the heart to tell her I was a lesbian. Oh, look at this. So I guess, alright, so I got my four crabs, right? Clean up at the beach completed. Thank you. Unfortunately, the beach seems to be turning a really dangerous place. Sea trolls. Aha. Uh -huh. So I get my experience, right? Some copper ore and a bunch of other stuff. This looks all like crafting supplies. So and some craft item. Cost. Yes. Crafting. Oh, we get a little cutscene. That's not what I asked for. It's the biggest dagger on earth. Now, I should be able to go back up here and get Tian. Oh ho, better than I expected. Nice. Complete. Da -da -da. Quick, I need you to do something for me. We stay here because we've made a pact with Injun, but we have a few obligations to fulfill. Find the archaeologist. I'm on it. Away I go. All right, now wait. So this is your um, skill tree. You can actually level up um, depending upon, you know, like you'll get like a little plus in the corner, and then when you click on the plus, then it'll upgrade the thing. Um, I'm just going straight up DPS, so I'm not going to fool around with any of the uh, magics and things like that. If this game turns out to be something worthwhile, then I'll do that later. Drunken Al. <laughs> Listen, my human friend. Yesterday, I saw some sea ebozies at the beach. Bah, I hate them. <laughs> Why don't you eliminate them for me? You drunken imbecile. I'm not just going to start slaughtering creatures because you're too drunk. No. Time to clear the beach. You can acquire items by breaking off parts from monsters? What is this? So one of the major problems with this game is that if you re-key bind, the game doesn't automatically update to the new re-key bindings, so you have no idea what's going on. And apparently, even though I turned off the tutorial under the options menu, it didn't actually turn off the tutorial. So it's still telling me things that are incorrect, even though I asked it not to. I need the Ebos to not stand next to the crabs. I don't have all day for this. Look, now I've aggroed everyone. You want some of this? Fish face? I'm coming over here where the Ebos are plenty. Look at that. Ooh. An Ebos hammer. This skill is Wow. <laughs> Oh, that's beautiful. Do, 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 do. You can learn a new skill. All right. So that's V for me. And what do we have here? All right. So first up, so I'm playing a, uh, I'm playing an assassin. All right. And so first up, we have the melee attack, right? We have cleave, 
which is um, attached to, I think, my right mouse button. Um, Cyclone Kick deals damage equal to 310% of physical attack. This is my passive, which uh, reduces damage and then increases your stamina by 8. And then Dagger Mastery, which is another passive, um, increases your physical attack by 2%. Now, these are obviously not available because I'm not a master of anything yet. I assume that if I buy enough of these, then the mastery will open up and you'll get to choose between them. It's my understanding that this game was developed in Korea, so I'm guessing that a lot of the names that you're going to be seeing in this are not necessarily as American as they should be. Go gather materials and I shall make you armor. Adios. Very well. this keeps up, you're going to be making me something out of crab meat. What? Die, hideous bird. What are you? What? Come pig. <laughs> it's time to die. Oh. He charged me. Bacon for everyone. Aw. Didn't give me anything for that. Rabbit. Guess who dies now? Oh, that's sad. I feel bad now. Oh, ugly. Look at this guy. Hey, get out of the way. Buddy. These guys look like they need a hand. Oh, we're mobbing. Come here. Wham, wham, wham. Ooh. Nice. That was all me. Oh, what's that? Ooh, they're rock people. Oh no, that's some sort of angry hippo. Die! Ball of fur off the iron hippo. I'm sure that makes sense. Somewhere in Korea, that makes sense. A double jump would come in really handy in this MMO. The Aberus Ruins. If there's an archaeologist anywhere, he'll be here. Run, 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 run. Oop, that was inappropriate. Run, 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 run. What is that? It is hideous. Some sort of massive frog? Look, he's... Look at this horn! What kind of... What kind of level is he? Oh, no. Oh, I aggroed him! I'm in trouble! No, horny toad, don't, don't come over here. Stay. Oh, oh. No, get, oh, run, jump through the rock. I didn't see that coming. He's so angry. <laughs> Ooh, hello. Not bad, not bad. I think I can do this. Keep stabbing. No, no. Here we go. Oh! <laughs> nice. If I look like that, I'd be angry too. Oh, that's sad. Ugh. I'd really like to be able to run. He's chasing me! <laughs> nice. Minor leg injury. I'm okay with it, though. Farewell, horny frog. No! <laughs> Are you kidding me? How far is he going to chase me? What kind of game is this? Yes. Yes. Smack this bear in the butt. Bam. Pigs and bears. Pigs and bears. I have no issues with the tree people. I'm going to let him stand. Death from above! Aw. Hello. Armor. Safety is... There's a big bird butt. So I'm at level 3, right? And this is extra special level 6 stuff. But I can get, like, shoes and things like that. Do I even have... I don't even have anything, do I? Oh, I do. Okay. So I've got these gloves and these boots. I have nothing important by way of... Can I do a helmet? Have a good day. Oh, that looks like... Oh, wait a minute. I don't Take know why I got booted out of that. 
Antique bandana, right? <laughs> I go totally blind at that point. I know you're out there. We can do a hat. What's that look like? That's the hat? I don't think so. It's a Russian snow cap. Look at this. Oh, there's a pirate. Ha oh, a priest hat. What's that look like? <laughs> nice! A pirate leather bandana. Preview that. Ah, that looks good. Too bad I can't wear it yet. <laughs> I want this hat! It's hideous! Craft that item! Leather, yes. I'll take it. Here is your item. Have a good da -da. day. All right, so I gained that, and it's here. I want to drag this onto my head. <laughs> oh no! It's worse than I thought. Look, it shows off more of my scar. Did you see all those birds just hop to attention like that? Design of your inferior armor, please. He clearly has not seen this hat yet. Get these birds out of here. Look at the size of this beast. You're covering up all of Tyan. I have made a vow not to kill any more rabbits. Look, he's so cute. He's tiny. Hello, friendly tree man. Speaks to me. He says nothing. That's a guy with a face made for radio. What are you? He's some kind of hideous beast. Die! Santa thief. I think the Koreans have a completely different holiday than we do. He's pretty slow for a thief, I gotta tell you. I thought he'd be more nimble. Don't come near, pig. Like the longest fight in history. Look at this. It's gonna take me forever to beat this guy. What have I gotten into? I've aggroed more people. The Santa thief won't leave it be. I'm not the droid that you're looking for. He's an old guy, big red coat, white beard. You can't miss him. I don't need tips. Make them stop. Why can't I make them stop? Die! Yes! Oh man, there is candy everywhere. Sweet. Dude, do not pick on the Santa thief. It takes forever and you can't unaggro anyone. I don't care how far you run, he will chase you. All right, so according to the journal, okay, it says that I'm looking for the archeologist Cargus at the Sacrum Ruins. Keep your eye out for a dead guy. I like how these guys are just patrolling the swamp. They're like, yeah, that's perfectly fine. Oh, look, there's a door. Vilnius, guardian of quotes. Ooh, hello. Bang, 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 bang. Down he goes, sweet. Crystal of the scholar, acquire all. All right, so I see that there's a question mark here at the Cargus encampment. I want a pigeon. Is everything Hello, right? archaeologist Cargus. He's fine. He's just standing here. You know what? I'm going to stick with the dagger mastery because I'm going to try and get this up to a full 5. I think that'll be I think that'll be good. So the good news is, if I dodge everywhere I go, this game will actually be bearable in that I'll be able to run at a normal speed. Choir runes of ceiling. All right, so that's two. Perfect. Quest, runes of ceiling complete. <laughs> this guy just completely collapsed on the ground. He's like, you must do something for me. 
Well, I think that's going to be it for now in terms of Raider Z. Um, I think that this game is actually pretty interesting, although I haven't really seen enough of the lore of the game to really kind of make a decision yet. But I think I'm going to try this one out for a little bit, and we'll see how it, uh, we'll see how it plays out. But for those of you who have watched this far, thank you for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please click the like button, share it with your friends, or subscribe to my YouTube channel for more content like this in the future. I'm Angelic Mayhem, and I'll see you next time.